Time to face the beast. Hi, Mark. Good evening, Kevin. It's a real pleasure to meet someone who's had more roles than I have at dinner. <laughs> well, let's put some money on the table. Seven grand. Low offer of, please. A grand. Thank you. High offer of? £80,000. <laughs> that means I've offered this team £265,000. You'd better have a chat with the team. I better. Yeah, OK, yeah. John, what do you think? I think we need you back here because we want to try and take that amount plus your seven with us. Mm. Thank you, Vicky. We've already got a lot, you know, in the pot, so I'd... I'd come back here, go with the seven. Why is Pat? We've done the hard work. Well, J JC has. Um, <laughs> we've got what we wanted. Um, I would take the one. We definitely need you back. It's worth more than any seven grand. We don't need it. Interestingly, we need you back here. that's a great tactic. Great. <laughs> wow, now, they might not like that. That is a great tactic. OK, look, that's great. Take you up to 160, 87, 81. It's entirely up to you. I'm going I'm to go for the 1,000. That's yes. great. Oh, I think that's <laughs> perfect. I think that's perfect. Yeah. And here we go. We'll go for one, please, Chaser. Taking the 7,000 would have been the most stupid decision you'd have ever made. Nothing is more important than getting a full house in the final chase. Here we go. Kevin, for a grand, the chase is on. Here we go. <laughs> Perfect. Absolutely. Here we go. Good luck. Here comes your first question. What term can refer to a style of French cinema, a type of science fiction and a branch of punk rock? A, New Wave, B, New Age, C, New Order. You put New Wave. I've got no idea. What is that in French cinema? Nouvelle Vague. Uh, a New Wave was a branch of uh, punk, which was kind of more like the jam rather than uh, the pistols. That's uh, your, that was your thing, though, punk, wasn't it? Kind of, yeah. yeah. yeah was, uh, I, I really did want to destroy the system. Um, <laughs> and uh, type of science fiction, yeah, new way. I'm pretty sure that. Correct answer is... I wouldn't know. I have no idea of this. Put it more close, that's like trying to see you Chase is put. Goes with new wave open. Was it new way Francois Truffaut? I wouldn't know. Uh, was he the French president? <laughs> his, <laughs> next, his next question. In 2016, who became the UK's first female Lord Chancellor? A. Theresa May. B. Liz Truss. C. Amber Rudd. Thank you very much. You have put Amber Rudd. I'm, now, I'm worried about that now because I've got a feeling that the Prime Minister could also be called the Lord Chancellor, so I'm not sure I've gone right now. <gasps> Correct answer is... Ooh. It's Liz Truss. Staying where we are. Chase has put. He knows all about trusses. <laughs> He's in. Moves to within three. The three from home. Here's the next question. What's that got to do with my knob is a line <laughs> from what Disney film? A, Beauty and the Beast. B, Pinocchio. C, Bed Knobs and Broomsticks. <laughs> You've put bed knobs and broomsticks. What's that got to do with my knob? Well, it <laughs> kind of my thought process has went a little awry. I don't know why, but I, I've gone for a, quite an obvious one, which might not necessarily be a good one. Correct answer is it has to be David Tomlinson, wasn't it? Yeah. Well done, Sir Chaser. I'm Chaser's book. Yeah, and also and Angela Lansbury, yeah. right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. And wasn't it to activate the magic you had to rub or twist the bed knob? I'm not sure. I mean, I always find the magic is released when you leave it. <laughs> uh, <laughs> here's the next question. The two from home. Chase is still three behind. The creator of which TV series said his goal was to turn Mr Chips into Scarface? A. Mad Men. B. Breaking Bad. C. House of Cards. You've put... Breaking Bad. 
got to be Breaking Bad, I think. Uh, main yeah. character is a teacher. So I think that's fairly safe, I think. Correct answer is... Well placed. That plays for Chase Chaser has put. Yeah. Here's the next question. One more, we're home and dry. Which of these groups was formed in the 1980s? A, status quo, B, simply red, C, Spice Girls? You've put simply red. I think Quo was 60s, probably about 1968, Spice Girls, 90s, I think simply red. The essence of 80s. To go through with a £1,000, the correct answer is... Come on, Kev, this'll do us, mate. 